Thank you, Tracy. Cleanup efforts in our Kentucky communities are now underway, and one of those being Charleston, Kentucky. 44 News reporter Emmy Fazenbaker is there showing us the mass destruction residents are now dealing with. Debris, rubble, and only pieces of prized possessions left behind. Hopkins County residents are trying to band together once again to get through yet another devastating severe weather event. Nearly two and a half years after the last tornado struck the area, Hopkins County residents are now seeing what unfolded on Sunday night. I've been down this road a hundred times and nothing looks familiar at all. It's really strange. Houses leveled, power lines everywhere, massive trees split in half, even cattle missing. The list goes on. For one older couple, they have now lost everything. I am told both of them were laying in bed with hard hats on as a severe weather tore their house and barn to pieces. All this, a lot of this stuff right here is irreplaceable. You can tell she's, she's heartbroken though. Now Kentucky is in a state of emergency and many leaders such as Mayor Sewell of Dawson Springs is advising her citizens to conserve water as thousands are still without power. Our power's been out for, I think we had three hours of electricity over probably the last 30 hours. And I, it's nothing nobody can do because look what it's, it's just ripped everything new. Like you said, it was new, it turned it into nothing. Volunteers have already began picking up debris, chainsawing trees, and collecting memorabilia along the way. Residents tell me they got through the last tragic event, and they will get through this one, too. Reporting in Hopkins County, Emmy Faisenbaker, 44 News.